Hello, my dear friends. So, um, uh, I decided to cancel uh, all my bits uh, that I made, low ball uh, bits on crypto. And every day I change my mind. Who knows? I put them back up tomorrow. But uh, but but I cancelled them uh, today uh, because um, because. Um, uh, even if the bits get hit uh, at minus 90% say that's where I put them uh, so for example actually I ended up with only buying two coins ethereum uh, and uh, and I uh, having bits for ethereum and for Bitcoin cash um, uh, and it was at around minus 90% uh, so so that's for ethereum around $150 and for Bitcoin cash around $400 uh, $430 um but but and 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 uh, and i still think that will be uh about the low uh but but actually i don't think this will be hit uh, i mentioned also before uh now even though the market is very it's becoming very bearish now but usually that means it's gonna go up now so i think actually uh, these kind of prices will not be hit yet uh we will get a rebound uh most likely for uh, some months or even half a year um, but likely Bitcoin um, dominance or Bitcoin market share will continue to go up so the strongest bounce will be for Bitcoin and and and, and, and the other ones will bounce less and this is a uh, interesting eh? because that's that's also typical characteristic of a bear market uh, usually when in a bull market when 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 market goes up again the alts will go up more but in a bear market actually they will not go up more um, uh, but I have to verify that if that's 100% correct anyways um, um, so uh, wh why did I remove my bits because well okay it's true in a flash crash they could already be hit um, and so that's why I made the previous video saying like mm, it's 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 smart to put them up already you never know it with with, with uh, crypto that's true uh, but um, uh, you never know with crypto that's true but it's a very low probability uh, and 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 even if it would be hit, and, and so you end up, uh, of in my case, I end up with a stash of Ethereum and an extra stash of Bitcoin Cash. Well, it's very early in the bear market, and so um, uh, it's uh, very unlikely that I will make profits on these stashes over the next uh, one to two years. Um, yeah, they may bounce hard, but then they will drop again to similar lows in one to two years' time. So. What's the point of holding these? Uh, this only makes sense if we get a new bull market. Eh? And so if this, the low gets hit now and then we get a new bull market, uh, uh, um, but the probability for that is very low, especially uh, since the stock market is struggling now too. And, and I really think that this is uh, very negative for crypto. Some people think that's a good thing for crypto, but I really don't agree with that. Um, Although there is certainly a case to be made that crypto has been bought by some um, uh, economists in difficulty, uh, uh, such as Venezuela, um, for example, or some people of the Cyprus crisis, uh, uh, they have started to use crypto um, uh, because of their own cryptocurrencies, uh, of their own fiat currencies being in trouble or their own banking system being in trouble. But this is a very small amount of people I estimate um, I think that, um, that that cryptocurrency markets are mainly supported by um, uh, the relatively rich Western and Eastern people uh, uh, investors uh, young and middle age uh, and so um, these these markets are influenced um, by the stock market uh, and, and in Asia and in the West stock markets have gone up since the last crisis in 2008 uh, in well uh, one straight line for nine years so it's the first time that we would get a, a stock market a global stock market correction and 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 so for crypto it's also the first time that it will correct while the uh, global markets are also correcting previous bear markets in 2011 and 2014 for crypto were uh, happening during uh, a, a stock market bull stock bull market so so this is the first time this will happen and i think will not help uh, the crypto bear market uh, no
it will not help it uh, it will likely mean that just um, becomes a little bit tougher the correction and maybe of similar and not less but similar uh, drawdowns as uh, happened in the last bear market of 2013 uh, 14 especially uh, even though market caps are a lot higher uh, volatility may, may end up being uh, the same but okay I would say that's not so probable also I still think uh, you have to count for less volatility but that means the low is still at minus 90 percent not minus 95 percent like the top 10 did in a lost bear market and some did nine on average they did minus 95 minus 97 the last bear market so less volatility means minus 90 percent uh, this time around but um <laughs> the timing needs to be right too uh, and that's what i'm missing here even if it hits already minus 90 percent which is a low probability uh, this uh, will likely only happen in one two years time but even if it happens today then still the timing is wrong to be in to be buying crypto right now um because yeah it's just very likely uh, that uh, it will continue to have a bear market for a long time and and that means that First, you're not going to make profits, uh, even though you have a bounce. You make some profits temporarily, but then they go away again. Um, and you lose, you lose um, opportunity. Uh, the opportunity cost here counts because your money is stuck in crypto. It means you can't invest it anywhere else. Uh, so, And there are some opportunities in the markets, especially now if we get a, a stock market correction then while well, certain uh, investments may prove to be very well over the next two years if you buy them during this year whereas for crypto i mean uh, I, I think the time to come back to crypto is not in one year but it's in three years time huh? so in three years time likely we will see the low not from the big coins but also from the smaller caps and that's 2020 at the end of 2020 that's a long period of time right? that's still from here two years and a half that's a long period of time right? but that's likely going to be the low for most coins even though a bitcoin and the bigger coins may have bottomed already in middle of 2019 early 2020 most coins uh, the, the, the mid caps and the small caps will, will likely once bitcoin starts to go up or ethereum starts to go up will continue to go down versus bitcoin ethereum uh, or, or Bitcoin Cash and so we'll find the low a lot later and, and it's only when that phase is finished that you can and so we've seen the, 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 the bear market finished for the big coins and the small coins only then it's worthwhile to go take a look at this market uh, and, 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 and the big advantage is uh, and also you don't have that now is that by that time you will have a much better uh, view on which coins have been performing well during the bear market uh, so have not corrected the strongest they have corrected the least that's a good sign but also um, have, have, have really continued to develop strong and it continue to gain adoption uh, and this is very important this is what needs to catch up with valuations is a real adoption and so but this takes time and so it will take probably two to three years at the same time of the finding the low for the bear market it takes also that time to see um, a, a, a real eye catching up of adoption and, and so at that point in time when the market is uh, well um, I when the interest for the crypto market has has waned a lot at the same time you will have a lot more information to see what has what's the real adoption here and then and then you can make much better informed decisions because right now for me it's like okay i want to buy bitcoin cash and ethereum but in two to three years time maybe that will have changed completely i yeah, because so much can change in the market so so these are the reasons why i i withdrew my bits and um and uh, and uh, and uh, and also the, the time like i'm still wasting time basically on following crypto market when it comes to valuations because I have these bits up I want to place these bits I want to buy cheap but I'm wasting my time there is nothing to be seen here in the crypto market when it comes to investing to make money there is nothing to be seen like there is no money to be made here there's only money to be lost really so the best thing from an energy efficiency standpoint is to just turn your back to this market uh, when it comes to making investments 
and uh, and look for and focus your energy on, on on the other markets where you can have a high probability to make money over the next two years or three years um, uh, and that also takes a lot of time I, I'm studying a little bit gold uh, uh, market and uh, uranium market and emerging markets like I'm getting a view on what's what are the, uh, the, 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 the opportunities here but I need to study a lot more to really make uh, decisions um, and um, so so that's also um, a good thing however like turning I'm not planning to turn my backs to crypto when it comes to really building the coin and and, and that I think is great to see eh? many developers that have not put so much value in, 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 in and don't spend their time on, on the price uh, or, or and are continu continuously focused on building uh, programming the coin or marketing the coin uh, like in the marketing world you also have people like that like Roger Ver you never hear him talk about the value of Bitcoin it doesn't interest him much he's really focused on getting finding seeing adoption and, 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 and that's the right thing to do uh, or, 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 it, uh, or Vitalik Buterin or, 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 or Tony uh, from, from Byteball or uh, like uh, many lead developers uh, really don't care much about the price really busy busy building uh, features and that's what that's what continues to need to be done uh, and, and in the marketing level also and and, um, and this is what I do want to put my energy in in crypto uh, but not buying cryptos no just with the cryptos I decided to hold during the bull market uh, and not to sell well yeah and that's for me but that is buy Paul and Bitcoin cash I want to start focusing on on really um, yeah help build build out uh, the coin marketing the coin so that that's gonna be my focus but first I need to focus on uh, investing the money I did make in crypto in the past bull market into uh, non crypto related uh, uh, stuff so that's gonna be my focus and after that uh, when that's done I plan to uh, really start to focus on uh, helping uh, these coins uh, and that likely be, will be in half a year a year and by that time well you will also have seen that many communities have much less people and it's a better also it's a good time to start really uh, um, really pushing uh, the coin um, because now there's a lot of negative energy in many of these communities also uh, people disappointed about price development uh, and uh, that can also be annoying because then they will blame everything on the, on the coin in, in, instead of looking at themselves and uh, when they decided to buy hmm. so um, that's it guys I hope you enjoyed the video please uh, share my, the, my video uh, 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 and also check my Twitter uh, subscribe to my tweets because often I make like I don't make that many videos uh, but I do tweet every day and those have my most recent thoughts on the market so so if you want to be kept more up to date please um, subscribe to my Twitter um, thank you so much for watching guys and have a great day bye